Need to get this done. Yeah, I mean, you see, this is a complicated deal. Unfortunately, it's not something that's going to get fixed quickly, but uh, certainly, you know, we, we need to do our best to try and. Because the problem is, once you've got these types of organisms in places where they're not supposed to be, the body doesn't really know how to get rid of them uh, because, you know. And that's why I've been sick. We're not supposed to have tuberculosis and. and see organisms in our fat tissue so when it sits there the other side is she's the complaining of it needs to get this done have you heard about dime girl girl let's talk about it it's another instagram model uh she got the procedure getting that bbl and it's not looking good look at here look at here she says, I have to stay in the hospital for six weeks because that doctor, uh, Bright Plastic, uh, what they did to her. She said they did her so wrong, y'all, and she going to talk about it. But uh, let's go through it. Comment, let us know what y'all think about this. We have another case of the BBL gone bad. And um, he still, this the doctor right here. Now, this is her. This is uh this happened I believe in October last year and she's having major complications. She said she had to be in the hospital for 6 weeks by herself. And it's so sad. You know she's smiling here. I play a little bit from Miami, Florida. Um we're just about to get um you know um, Diamond's case done. Um Diamond has had previous uh, LiPo360 um, with a BBL. What we're going to do, in essence, is to help. But as you guys can see, uh, this is her with the doctor. You know, this is her with the doctor. And look at the people in the comment section. They are they going off of that man. They said, learn how to clean your surgery tools. Delete this. Y'all almost took her out. Don't go here. Delete this. Delete this. Look at them. Isn't she in the hospital as a result? Look at this, four hours. This is recent, y'all. Dime said delete this. She want to delete it. But I guess the surgery man said it's not his fault. I don't know. But uh, listen here. This is her uh, speaking out, as you guys can see. She's been in the hospital for over six weeks. She putting them on blast, y'all. Yes, she is. She putting a doctor on blast. So let's go here. You guys, Dime has a message she want us to read. Check this out. She says she's blocking every negative comment. Okay? She said, so unfortunately, I just found out that I will be having to stay in the hospital for over six weeks and maybe more. November the 29th, I received the surge from plastic, bright and plastic, operated by that doctor. I ain't going to say his name. I received lipo and I got my hips done. Things began to have a tragedy turn. I got an infection, y'all, which the doctor going to tell me it's normal. He going to say, I don't have no infection. Y'all, I was seeking pain pills. I don't even smoke, y'all. He was so rude and nasty to me. Mind you, the infections and the tools that he used on me are so extreme that I had to be admitted to the hospital again and put on antibiotics for a very long time and then told me that I could be there for six weeks or more. I am very depressed about this whole situation, but I definitely will learn from this whole experience. You know, it's crazy how they reached out to me, made me sign a contract just to mess me up and not even care to clean the tools before using them on me. This had made me very emotional and depressed, y'all. I won't even have nobody by myself doing this journey. That's the part that saddens me also. I don't deserve this and neither do any of you all. So please don't book them. I can't even be around my kids either because they are not allowed here at the hospital. My life really sucks right now, but I know how to stay strong. Trust me, I've been through a lot, y'all. This ain't going to take me out, but guess what? If it do take me out, I died not giving up. I appreciate my love and support from all of y'all. 
I have to be back in the hospital by Monday. They allowed me to, to leave so I can figure out what I'm going to do with these puppies. All right, so uh, a lot of her fans is, you know, sharing her wishes. Whew, you know, I, y'all got to be careful with them BBLs. And um, I wanted to know what the people are saying because you know I got this from a blog site. They said, why do a lot of women want to look like blow-up dolls today? I guess because the men love it. Uh, Self-esteem in the toilet, that's why. Um, then they're going to say... Black women be having fake behinds, fake hair, fake nails, fake eyelashes, fake eyebrows, fake breasts, and a face full of war paint. They always want to preach about a real man. They solve their problems with surgery or blaming black men. Okay, well you you already know it. You already know how they get down on these blog sites. Mm mm mm. Girl, comment. Let us know what you guys think about this. You know, it's the same and a tragedy. You know, hopefully she'll pick up from this. You know, she's an Instagram model, y'all. Comment, let us know what you guys think. And I'm going to see y'all on the next video.